Well, um, many people, um, when they've done, spent a, a lifetime doing research, they write a book, uh, sort of summarising it, and uh, um, it's. Uh, this seemed to me to be a, an alternative to that, and uh, probably more fun uh, because it has a lot of three-dimensional stuff in that I'd never done, and and uh, modelling and things. So it was a new way of uh, of uh, doing it. Um, but in fact, I've had a long relationship with Pico, um, with the whaling here. I saw them commercially whaling originally and studied whales here, and. Um, uh, it's always struck me since uh, whale watching has taken off and the whaling's gone and uh, now we get tourists here. It seemed unfortunate to me really that they had two whaling museums, one on the commercial process and one on the um, way that the whale whalers killed the whales. It's called a whalers museum. But they had nothing on the biology of this wonderful animal, which has lots and lots of tricks that no other animal has, and um, it is a superlative performer. Um, so it, it's it's a, a great thing to talk about. And here they have uh, whale watching, during which people see the the top of the whales going, and they sometimes even swim with dolphins and things, but they really don't see very much of the whale or and they don't understand at all the wonderful mechanisms it has to to live. Um, and so I talked, uh, I think it was nine years ago now, with a local museum to try to get a gallery that we might uh, illustrate something of the whale's biology in, and uh, they didn't have the room. And it's got, it went on and on and on, and in the end I thought I was going to be able to use the local whaling station when it was rebuilt, but that fell through. And, uh, you know, you get older and uh, you think, well, better do things <laughs> on your own if, um, if nobody uh, is going to come up with anything, uh, uh, facilities for a building or anything. I, we decided to put it in our garage. It's always been fun to be with you, and there are few people I think I learned so much from as I learned from you, just in talking to you. And you enjoyed it, and I enjoyed it. And uh, so actually this is a, an invitation. An invitation to anyone coming to Pico to, to share that joy of being with Malcolm and having him show, <laughs> show the museum. <laughs> and it's, it's really astonishing. We, we can only cover here a small part of what Malcolm is actually has collected in, in knowledge and in insights uh, from not only sperm whale of squid but from uh, intelligent species in general and all kinds of topics that he's absolutely expert at and it's really fun to be with him his, his very English humor too and he, he's one of the people who could absolutely laugh about themselves and make jokes about them himself and uh, it's just a pleasure to be with him and I hope that a little of that pleasure comes through here in, in this video. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Thank you, Fritz. <laughs> You're quite welcome. <laughs>